Hey guys, what's up Capricorn? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be your reading for your immediate future. <clears throat> the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. Keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with, which will flop it how you need to. Also, keep in mind, this is a general reading, so take what's yours, what's the left behind. If this does resonate with you today, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below as well. Alright, media future for the cat. Wow, someone makes you happy or something. Maybe a pizza for Capricorn. All right, I don't know how it's going. It's confusing as hell. You have the power though. Number three, not to a one. New beginning. So it's about the three of swords. That could be about heartbreak. That could be about pain. That could be someone at a distance, right? It feels like whatever the situation is, is taking a long time to clear up. But the Knight of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Energy, and then also the Chariot, things are moving forward. There could be an offer coming, but you're slowly moving away from this pain. Um, Alright, so yeah, you've been held back, but there's someone or something that you're still holding on to. Been doing some healing. It's all about divine timing. With the will of fortune here but you do have good luck on your side and the power to manifest but with the four of swords there's someone possibly that you're still holding on to but you've been healing you've been trying to heal from this heartbreak or the separation um things are moving forward but they are moving forward slowly it feels like they're increasing here but with the Knight of Pentacles, that is the slowest moving night in the deck. So it's like you're slowly taking your time getting back on track, finding some type of balance here. Doing some healing from some heartbreak, some pain, something like that. Or someone that's at a distance from you. But now things are changing. Time's, time's moving. It's only a seven of cups for Capricorn. The moon and the six of cups. I'm sorry, the six of pentacles. The moon is Pisces energy. Why the moon? Someone may have had options or was the buyer in their time and energy. Or it could just, oh, so there is something new coming. Could be multiple things. And like I said, you have the power to manifest it. You could be keeping this hidden. You may have options. You may have choices to make here. But there's there's somebody taking no action towards it. It could be confusion on how to balance it out because it looks like things are trying to balance out. But with the two of swords and the hangman, that's like somebody, um, it's almost like refusing to look at any other perspective, um, whether it's on, it doesn't have to be that, and that could be this person's side. But it's a stalemate situation, like somebody's just not moving here. And usually, with, sometimes with the hangman, you know, it's, it's kind of like a self-sacrifice, like, nope, not moving type thing. Why are the six of pentacles? Somebody could have a lot going on. Um, somebody could block communication. Somebody could be given to more than one person. Although, it, yeah, see, you could have a lot of options right now. Or you're just standing in your confidence. But this, this is, there's been, like, no movement. So why the ace, like, the salt is there of something new, possibly reconciling or making the decision, but it has not been acted on. Show me this magician for Capricorn, please. 
All right, Aries energy with the Emperor, Aquarius energy with the Star, and the Two of Pentacles. So there's either a decision or a, cho or a choice, or it's like still holding on to hope for a situation that something can be rebuilt, can, something can be refixed. So somebody's going back to manifesting that, this new opportunity. Um, but with the Two of Pentacles there, you could possibly be making that choice or like starting to move towards making a choice more so than this has been. Even if that choice is just to move forward or, you know, to move towards something, this thought, the Ace of Cups and the Six of Swords, towards this new beginning. There's a new beginning in love and things. It looks like it starts to balance out. So that's why the wheel is here, because things are actually starting to move after a time where starting a new project, a new relationship, um, something that you have a lot of love and passion for. The thought was here, but somebody was just confused or like taking no action. So it's actually starting to take that action. You do have the Ace of Cups, which is a new beginning, a fresh start. Could be moving or traveling, um, but it's like you feel intrigued. You feel good about this. It may still be a little uncertain, but it's much more, it's like somebody finally taking the steps. The Six of Wands, victory, happiness. So you have quite a three, you have sixes here, which are all about that balance, that harmony. You could be seen in the public eye, but you're feeling good here. Taking your time, investing time and energy, but there is a fresh start, a new beginning. Could be with an Aquarius, but this is like, if, with the star card, you're manifesting your wish. <clears throat> and you're moving towards it now. So there's actually movement. Things are changing. All right, chat. Hope this helped. Hope this resonated. If so, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below as well. You guys take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.